Welcome back uh, to this, this series of differentiation videos that I'm making. Uh, if you have seen my previous videos, I differentiated this function and uh, the trig function. And in the first video, I differentiated this. So this is the third video in the series. I have copied and pasted the formula list, formula, list of uh, formulas for differentiation. Okay, so here again a trick function you got y is equal to 10 squared x. So I'm going to say y is equal to, can I write this as 10 x squared? Now that, of course, you should be knowing that 10 squared x is 10 x the whole squared. Okay, so I'm going to let uh, 10 x or u as 10 x. Okay, so this becomes. So now let me differentiate with respect to x. So I say, okay, d by dx of u is equal to d by dx of d by dx of d by dx of 10x. I have used the derivative operator on both sides. So d by dx of u is nothing but du by dx. Okay, the derivative of 10 x is 6 squared x. So I can say this is 6 squared x. So I will put this away somewhere out here and I may use it later. Okay, now this function, so I'll let y is equal to, I'll let u is equal to 10x. So this function now can be written, let me change color. So can I write therefore y is equal to u squared. So now I'm going to differentiate with respect to u. So can I say d by du of y is equal to d by du of u squared. Differentiation is really uh, interesting. So d by du of y is nothing but dy by du. Is equal. Now differentiating with respect to u of u squared is drop the power down and decrease the power by 1. So that is pretty easy. So this is dy by du is 2u. Okay, now we have to use the chain rule again a different color so can i say dy by dx we want to find dy by dx that's because your function is with respect to y and x so that when they're asking you they're asking you what is dy by dx okay that's the question okay so i can say well dy by dx is nothing but dy by du times du by dx so let me repeat this there's nothing wrong in repeating certain things so here, when you're uh, looking at these dy and du, they're not letters, they are numbers. They're very small, infinitesimally small number. This is also an infinitesimally small number. So what I'm saying is this and this gets cancelled. So what are your left is dy by dx on both sides. So this and this are equivalent. Okay, therefore, dy by dx is equal. Now what is dy by du? We know dy by du is u times what is du by dx du by dx is sec squared x so i can write sec squared x okay now you have to put this back into x form because you're writing in terms of y and x so what is x sorry what is u u is 10x so therefore dy by dx is 2 10x times 6 squared x, just like that. Okay, so let, let me do one more video, sorry, one more question on differentiation. So this is a power function, so I'll use the chain rule. So let this whole thing be u. So u is equal to x cubed plus x. So I'm going to use differentiate with respect to x, so d by dx of u is equal to d by dx of <coughs> x cube plus d by dx of x. So d by dx of u is nothing but du by dx is equal to. Now when you're differentiating x cube, this is a power function, so the, it is very simple. Drop the power down and decrease the power by 1. So 3x squared plus. What is the derivative of x okay so the or you're asking 
what is the gradient of this function. Okay, so, the gradient is 1. Okay, so, that is 1. So, du by dx is 3x squared plus 1. So, let me change color. Okay, so, <coughs> now this function, therefore, y has become u to the power 4. So, can I say dy by du or d by du of y is equal to d by du of u to the power 4. So, dy, d by du of y is nothing but dy by du is equal to, again the power rule, it is 4u to the power 3. And let me substitute back here. So, what is u? u is x cubed plus x. So, dy by du in terms of x is 4 times x cubed plus x to the power 3. Okay, now we have to use the chain rule. So, let me change to blue. So, I'm going to write now like this. dy by dx is equal to dy by du times du by dx. Okay, therefore, dy by dx is equal to, what is dy by du? This is this. That is 4 times x cubed plus x, the whole cube. Hopefully, I have not done any mistake. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. And what is du by dx? du by dx is 3x squared plus 1. That is 3x squared plus 1. Now, how to do this without going through this du and d? dy by du and composite rule. So, let me do the second method, which is a smarter method. As calculus students, you should know how to do the smarter way. So, well, let me write the question again. y is equal to x cubed plus x to the power 3. 4, sorry. x cubed plus x to the power 4. So, I'm differentiating in one step. So, you say it's very pretty easy. You differentiate the inside. Okay, so differentiating the inside, you get 3x squared plus 1 times. I need to differentiate the whole function. So that is 4 times decrease the power by 1. That is x cubed plus x to the power 3. And this and this are the same. So let me simplify this a little. So therefore, dy by dx, dx is equal to 4 times 3x squared plus 1 times x cubed plus x to the power of 3. See you in the next video.